Hello everyone and welcome to a new tutorial. Today we're going to be creating a weekly spread on Zinnia using some of Mami Leahy's artwork. So first I'm going to be importing and coloring our preppy mermaid on the pigment app and then I'm going to take it over to Zinnia and use it in my weekly spread. Now let's go ahead and get started. So first I'm going to start by laying down my base colors and this is where you can kind of determine the theme of your page. So you can change up the hair color and just color everything accordingly and I'm not going to be coloring the background, I'm just going to be keeping it white because I'm going to be removing it later on to help merge the artwork with the spread. Here I'm just adding a little bit of dimension to the mermaid's tail, not only as shadows and highlights, but I'm also going to be drawing some texture and spend time doing this because this artwork is going to be the focal point of our spread.
Now I'm gonna go ahead and save this artwork to my gallery and I'm gonna be removing the background off camera and come back to you on Zinnia. Opening a new page on the app, I'm just going to be changing my background color to this minty blue green and then I'm going to be inserting my artwork from my gallery and just center that on the page. It helps if you have the dotted grid page layout turned on so that you can use that as a guide. Taking a white color on the technical pen tool, I'm just going to go around the artwork and then select the artwork itself and bring it forward so that it creates more of a die cut sticker effect. Once I'm done with that, I'm just going to group everything so that it's easy to resize and move it around. Now I'm going to be doing a quick search for some of Mommy Leahy's content on the app. So I'm going to be inserting some dates and I'm going to be resizing everything together so that it stays consistent and gonna be arranging those dates around the spread. Next, I'm gonna be inserting some hand-lettered days of the week. Now I'm just going to be using a white color and highlighting the days of the week and then I'm going to be layering that backwards and then grouping each day to work as a sticker. Now I'm going to go ahead and fill in my spread so that you guys can get a better idea of how it's going to look. I'll also be using some icons to indicate and highlight some of our notes. And that's pretty much it for today. I hope that you guys have enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching and good luck!